Hey everyone, welcome. It is Jeff with Half Fast Gaming. Uh, this is the holiday special, or you know, whatever you want to call it. I hope you guys have a uh, great holiday, great Christmas. If you've had a great Hanukkah, that's great as well. Um, and of course, going into 2018, a great year. Um, and I hope that you're spending time with family and friends. If you are not, I'm sorry, but I hope you're having a gr good time somehow or another. In any rate, this is the Blender Tools tips and tricks tips and tricks action video special enhanced version etc 2.0 what does that mean you say well I will tell you we're gonna be over in blender I've been working on uh, Jesse's Uh, 9513 Ford day cab um, I've exported a ton of the accessories and stuff like that you can see some nodes here however I'm going to show you something regarding um, one of the accessories and how I found it easier to deal with putting them where they need to go so obviously we've imported the truck the uh, cab spoiler here is where it needs to be um, but sometimes when you assign these things to their parent things go a little haywire um, and I'm going to show you how to kind of alleviate that basically what we're going to do is we're going to select the root node cursor to selected there's our cursor so we're good there um, now this one I've already done um, as you can see, the root locate—I mean, the uh, origin location—is up here. But if I click on this, the origin location is the original location of the truck. So what happens is, when you assign this, we'll just say parent cab def l01. You can see this goes way up here, and what it's doing is since the origin was down here it's taking the distance between these two points and adding it and putting it up here but we don't want it up there we want it on top of the truck um, so this is how to kind of alleviate that in a fairly easy manner um, basically we're going to utilize the uh, tools portion over here um, you're going to select the item which in this case is wing F for frame set origin origin to 3D cursor so now you can see that moved up here see if I control Z it's down here if I press this it moves up there because I've put my cursor on the point of where the root node is going to be um, so in this case we're now going to go here and we're going to drop this onto there and we're in default part and there we are going to do the same with this let's undo that drop this up here assign that and that's it. That is how how easy that is. So now, when we select this, all the parts are there. Because the origin point was changed to the top of the truck, because that is where the root node is, and that's what we care about. Now we can go over here. go to our vehicle truck upgrade oh I didn't add the cab def folder yet stand by I will do that quickly OK, 
Okay. Truck upgrade cab def L. Select. There it is. Done. So that is how you I've been exporting these accessories. It goes super quick. Just assign them to the uh, just assign that using the set origin 3D cursor point. And it's pretty straightforward. Works like a charm. No fuss, no muss. Uh, don't have to worry about calculating how far this went and minus that and so on with the, uh, you know, transform stuff. So super easy. Hope this, got, hope this helps you guys. Um, again, have a great holiday. And we'll see you for the next one.